How to use a Bloom Trading Bot Solana. Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can use Bloom Trading Bot Solana. So let's get started. You can click on the link given in the description below in order to get an access to it. And once you click on that, you'll be redirected to an interface like this. So you're gonna click on start. And once you click on start, you'll be able to see something that will say like this. It will welcome you to Bloom and this would be your private key. So you can just copy it and paste it over somewhere. And then you'll have your Solana wallet address and you're going to click on start trading. So once you click on start trading, you'll be able to see a couple of options here. Here are options like positions. So you can, you know, add some new positions. And here you can see that there is no position yet, but you can start your trading journey by pasting a contact address in chat. And after that, we have the LP sniper. That is basically right now, it is not active, but you can create a task or, you know, create a pro account and you can even close some. And then we have option that is copy trade. So you can either add new config and you can change your copy wallet. But remember to remake your tasks to use the new wallet for future transactions. And then we have over here that is AFK mode. We have limit orders. We have referrals. If your friend or family has referred you over here. So you can just check that over here. And you can even see that how many people have joined this specific trading bot using your referral link. And then we have withdraw. You can add any of your withdrawal address over here. And then we have settings where you'll have multiple options like fee, wallet, slippage, presets, dig in mode, MEV protect, and you know some other stuff. And then we have if you wish to close the account. So that was basically how you can basically use the bloom trading bot solana if you found this story helpful give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more helpful tutorials i'll see you in the next video